Hi guys, so today's video, at the beginning of this video, is going to be a get ready with me and I'm just going to update you guys on what's been going on with my life. I've been <laughs> running around. First, I bought these beer can glasses from Amazon and they are so cute, but one of them came shattered, so I need to make a claim, but the rest of them are fine and they're really cute, so just have my iced coffee today is monday i am on my day off from my full-time job but i still have my part-time job to go to in a few hours so i'm gonna do my makeup and yeah just show you what my everyday makeup is for work i have a pimple i just got this overnight and i'm kind of stressed out about it but if i pop it it's gonna get worse so i'm just gonna cover it up so what I've been doing, most of it is the same things. I just switched up a couple products. First, I'm going to use my Unseen Sunscreen as a primer. I love this stuff. Okay, the coffee is just not kicking in. So if I start to get hyper, that's why. I really like this sunscreen because I don't really wear foundation, which could be a good thing, could be a bad thing, but I need to find like a skin tint to even up my skin because my skin is just not it lately but yeah i have to wear this a uh, sunscreen because i don't wear foundations and i'm always in the sun and i'm getting a lot of sunspots um and i really don't want my skin to age too much now that i'm older so yeah i did get my hair done last week what it looks like i i love it um, so now I need to work on keeping it as blonde. I have brass off because I, we have wall water and it's a little hard water, but not too much. Um, but now I'm just going to use my e.l.f. Hydrating Camel Concealer. I had this like last year and I loved it so much. So I'm so I bought another one and this one matches me pretty well right now over my more than my closest one this one is too yellow so i do need to go down a few shades i still have not tried out this tart one i really need to do a video of trying them and also this woke concealer that's in my project pan this one still matches but i've been loving this one a lot more <sighs> my voice is a little messed up because i just woke up so i just really love this to brighten up my under eyes and bring it down to my cheeks because my redness on my cheeks i haven't really got it confirmed if it was rosacea but i'm pretty sure it is so i just tone it down a bit and just brighten my under eyes get that pimple oh no it's not gonna work oh no so yeah i've been really busy with work i have just been so exhausted finally I feel like I'm in the groove of my full-time job. I have it down to where I am up all night doing work. And when I get my days off, I literally sleep all day. So this past week, I was supposed to have two videos go up. But I just could not get the energy to wake up. And that is why I missed, I think, two days. I have the videos. So I'm just going to... I just edited one of them. That will be posted for this week and then this video will be posted for this week also but I'm just trying to get a hang of balance but it's just really hard when you have to sleep all day to recharge your battery yeah that's not gonna work i might just clean it off honestly yeah my under eyes are still bad but i really don't want to add more i'm not all about layering <clears throat> i like a one layer and that's it so if you see imperfections, that's okay. I am actually going to use bronzer, I think, for the first time in a while. <laughs> I'm going to use my NARS Laguna bronzer. I bought this last year and I've only swatched it. But, oh no, it's gonna be so dark. Wait, no. Let me see which one is darker. Okay, that one's pretty dark. 
So the Laguna bronzer is the darker one. And e.l.f. is the lighter one. I didn't even use my e.l.f. Because it is my project pan and I've been using it so much. I am filming my project pan update today and I'm excited. I don't want to do too much makeup. I'm really excited to film it finally. I have some new pans. I have an update. You guys already know. I'm just a few weeks behind. It's just work has been kicking my butt. And it's finally fall you guys it is finally fall and i'm really excited i love fall i just love wearing sweaters and being warm and wearing boots and all that but i hate the cold so much i just hate it so hopefully winter isn't too bad but we never know traveling i do have my vacation coming up and i just feel a little stressed about it honestly i just don't know I just feel like I'm not going to have enough money saved on time, but because bills just keep piling up. But I just gotta keep focused. Next, I'm just going to do my eyebrows real quick off screen because it takes a minute. Okay, so I did my mascara <clears throat> and my eyebrows because it just put your face together um i was gonna do my under eyes but i don't think i need it yet i might need this later though i've been actually using under eye powder which is insane because i never use powder but sometimes it just looks like it needs it um so just can't get past this pimple <laughs> i'm going to use my bare minerals bronzer this is a bronzer or blush and bronzer which i don't know how it could be a bronzer because it is so pink um and pigmented i just don't see that ever being a bronzer i need to wash my brushes today yeah so i'm just going to use a little bit of this because it will give me some color see that <laughs> already um so i am reading the secret history but man that book is going to take me like, I don't know how many weeks because the writing, the print in the book is so small. So I just don't see myself finishing it in one week. I mean, it's already been a week and I have not finished it. So I'm going to try to finish it this week, but it's just taking a long time. It's so good. I don't know why I waited so long. It takes a long time to read these pages and it's giving me so much fall vibes dark academia vibes and i'm loving it so much like i am absolutely loving the plot the scenes everything i just feel like i'm there and it's really amazing so i see why her book has been very like a best bestseller for over 20 years i think but yeah so i'm reading that i might start another book I don't know it's hard for me to read two books at one i might just do like a two-part vlog where i read the book because i just don't want to have a long vlog that goes on for two weeks straight so that's probably what i'm gonna do but i also have a stephen king book coming in the mail i should begin in a few days and i also have a few stephen king books and thriller books that i want to read so i need to start that so this is my makeup that i usually do for work just a simple cover up <laughs> except for this pimple i am so sorry guys um but yeah so now i need to go get ready and film my other two videos um i hope you guys enjoy this little makeup chat this is just a quick update to let you guys know that i'm here i'm alive and i'm just a little stressed out with everything but bear with me i feel like i do these like every few weeks but like life just it gets easy and then it gets hard and i just need to come back to it so yeah oh yeah my mascara that i used is the covergirl lash blush clean but i think it's going dry so it might be done because it is really clumpy um but i do have my maybelline falsies that i'm using also i did not put it on today but i'm probably just gonna start this one tomorrow but yeah and then i use my benefit 24 hour brow setter to set my brows to help keep them um even though this is this is an extra step i've really been liking this but i do want to try an, 
like other brands that's going to be it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed let me know um how your day is going how your week has been um if you enjoy these little catch up videos with me i do love to film them but i know they just get repetitive and boring but for my sake it helps me get back on track and just connect with you guys again so yeah thank you guys for watching and i will see you in my next video bye